Lady Gabriella Windsor, affectionately known as Ella by her friends and family, made a dazzling return to the public eye as she joined King Charles and Queen Camilla for the first day of Royal Ascot. Her appearance marked a poignant moment, as it was her second public event since the tragic passing of her husband, Thomas Kingston, earlier this year. Dressed in an elegant pale pink floral dress with a matching hat, Lady Gabriella was the epitome of grace and charm. Her radiant smile shone as brightly as the ascot sunshine, capturing the hearts of onlookers and fellow royals alike. She took her place in the second carriage of the royal procession, accompanied by Princess Anne, her son Peter Phillips and John Warren, the royal family's racing manager. In a touching display of solidarity, Zara Tyndall warmly embraced Lady Gabriella upon her arrival at Royal Ascot. The heartwarming images of the hug symbolised the close-knit bonds within the royal family, especially during such a challenging period for Ella. Despite the sorrow that has marked her recent months, she carried herself with a light-hearted elegance that did not go unnoticed. King Charles and Queen Camilla led the royal procession in the first carriage, joined by Charles Wellesley, the ninth Duke of Wellington, and his wife, the Duchess of Wellington. The second carriage, featuring Lady Gabriella, was followed by a third carriage carrying Camilla's sister, Annabel Elliot, her son, Sir Ben Elliot, the Earl and Countess of Halifax, and in the final coach, Sir Johnny Weatherby, the racehorse trainer, Ralph Beckett and his wife. Lady Gabriella's return to Royal Ascot was a full circle moment. Just last year, she and her late husband attended the event together, sharing joyous moments in the royal box with King Charles and Queen Camilla. Their laughter and excitement as they watched the horse racing remain vivid memories for those who were there to witness it. This year, Ella's presence at Royal Ascot, invited by the King, was both a testament to her enduring connection with the royal family and a reflection of the family's unwavering support. At the weekend's Trooping the Colour, another significant royal event, she made a low-key appearance, observing the parade with family members inside Buckingham Palace. She stood beside her brother, Lord Frederick Windsor, and his wife, Sophie Winkleman as they watched the RAF fly past from the palace's interior. Lady Gabriella's sartorial choices throughout these appearances have been impeccable. For the Trooping the Colours, she wore a stylish light pink ensemble and matching fascinator, capturing the essence of regal elegance. Her fashion sense, much like her demure, has been consistently sophisticated and understated. The tragic passing of her beloved husband, Thomas Kingston, in February was a devastating blow. Couple who married in a fairy tale wedding at St George's Chapel in Windsor Castle in 2019 had shared nearly five years of married life. Kingston was a respected director at Davenport Capital and had a fascinating past as a hostage navigator in Iraq. His sudden death at the age of 45 left a void in the lives of many especially Lady Gabriella. Despite this profound loss, Lady Gabriella has shown remarkable poise and strength. Her appearances at recent royal events, though subdued, have been marked by a quiet dignity. The royal family has surrounded her with support and her participation in events like Royal Ascot signifies a gradual return to the public sphere. As Lady Gabriella continues to navigate her grief, her involvement in royal duties and public appearances reflects not only her resilience, but also the enduring love and support of her family. Her presence at Royal Ascot, greeted with warmth and affection by Zara Tindall and others, underscored the deep bonds that tie the royal family together, especially in times of personal hardship. Lady Gabriella Windsor's journey is one of grace amidst sorrow and her radiant smile at Royal Ascot was a hopeful sign of her moving forward, embraced by the love of her family and the public's admiration.